real fast. Um, for those of you guys that don't know me, my name is Jonathan Mal Lalalo Maldonado, and um, you know I kind of just speak about everything that I see online. You know I do a lot of everything online. I post to all platforms. I truly, truly, truly do post to all platforms. I post to LinkedIn, Facebook. Twitter, Instagram, I have three YouTube channels, I have TikTok, I have everything you could possibly think of, right? I even stream on my game, I even stream games with my son, I do it myself, and I stream to four or five platforms. I actually try to get into LinkedIn, but I haven't been approved yet. As soon as I'm able to live stream, I'll be live streaming on here, it'll basically be gameplay and such. But on my downtime, what I like to do is, I like to, Get online on every platform and just kind of like stay in that motion, right? I think too many of us have it in our head where it's like, okay, I don't know what to create. I don't know what to put out or I'm scared to, right? It's either, it's probably one of those two things, right? One of those two things is probably in your head right now. It's like, I don't know what to create or I don't, or I'm too scared to. So if you're too scared to, I'm going to tell you this. Um... Stop being so because in 10 years, literally, the the longer you, you press that record button, the more value you'll be bringing to the world, the more people, customers that will come into your, your ecosystem, your business, or whatever it is you build, right? You don't see it yet because you haven't even started yet, right? So hopefully you do start and you do start to see that. If you haven't started, then I could only encourage you to do it right when the beginning is gonna be tough I'll tell you that because again you're gonna ask yourself what do I create right so then you get to the point of okay I want to create 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 I'm gonna tell you off the jump don't do not create oh you just said create create all right there's let me break it down to you there's a there's a process called documenting versus creating and I took that from the one and only the, the GOAT the best entrepreneur in the world in the world in the states of <laughs> Gary V man shout out to you and you know documenting versus creating has had definitely it's like I don't know how to explain it but it's the fucking best it's like a cheat code it's a cheat code to content right in the beginning, it is so fucking confusing. You just want to create. You have it in your head right now that you want to create, but I am telling you that you are wasting your time by trying to create first before documenting it, right? You are still going to create, but in a different way, right? So what documenting is, right, it's when you decide to do either a podcast, a TV show, a painting, whatever it is, a show. I consider it a show, any type of show. Do that for about an hour, right? You document that hour, right? So you go, you record your little hour, and let's say in the hour, uh, first 30 minutes was um, a, a conversation you had with a friend of yours, and then the next 10 minutes was a painting that you did, and then the next 10 minutes was uh, a song that you decided to freestyle for your fans, and then let's say the final 20 minutes was just a rant, um, for people about uh, on LinkedIn about something, right? That right there, basically what I just said was a structure that I, I freestyled that there was no specific structure um, that you would take, you know, like those 10, 20 loop, like those are old videos, right? So hypothetically speaking, let's say that we get four videos out of that one hour, right? Now, we didn't have to create the content initially that we were gonna sit there and talk about no 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 you sit down you make a show you're like okay what is it that I want to make and whatever it is that you make you just speak your truth and whatever it is you're going through at the moment it's as simple as that just speak about whatever it is you're going through at the moment like me this is what I am going through at the moment I am going through um, click funnels one funnel away challenge and I picked up an epiphany bridge script and it kind of helps you like with storytelling and things like that and if there's anything that I took value from it was probably just that the the script the fact that in order to make a good story it has to have this 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 and this I picked that up from it 
you know, and you know that's what I'm going through right now. And I'm just speaking about it to you guys. And um, yeah, you know, for those of you guys that don't have anything, just do that. Document, right? So record or go live. I'm not even gonna say the live thing because I'm just gonna overwhelm you. So forget I said that and just go live. Here we go with the shit. You guys are getting me nervous. But just go and document. That's what I mean. Document, right? So the only step you actually have to do, honestly, the only step you have to do is sit down and plan for a year. One year. The one hour a day for one year. Do that for an entire year and see if things don't change for you. Holla at me in a year. And if things didn't change for you, if you uploaded every single day for one hour and you tell me that things didn't change for you, then I owe you some money. Because I just wasted so much of your time. But I could tell you time and time again, I've seen this happen over and over and over and over and over again. Guys, it's crazy what happens in three years to people's lives. They go from here to here, right here to right here. And I'm not saying all the way up here, but just from right here to right here. It doesn't matter what accomplishments you, you made accomplishments in that time frame. And the amount that you make in that time frame is so much, it only makes you wonder, like, damn, life is so long. How far can I really make it? You know, how far can I really push myself? And this is what, what, what you got to ask yourself, dog. How far am I going to push myself, right? So if you're just starting, please just record one hour and do exactly that. If you need help with any of it, I have templates of any kind. Just please feel free to reach out. Closed mouth does not get fed. All right? So if you need something, just speak up and I'll find a way to get it to you. So what else do we have? Um, right now I'm going through TikTok, right? So it's LinkedIn and TikTok. I'm using LinkedIn more as a blogging. Right, so more the me venting about my everyday life kind of thing, my whole business life, what it is that I'm doing, what it is, little strategies and things like that. Right now with TikTok, something that I'm doing is I'm following a lot of people that have a lot of people, right? Because if they have a lot of people, then that means that they've been catering to people or they know what they're doing or they got lucky or whatever it is. But nine times out of ten, when I go into it, you, it's pretty simple to do your research. You click into a person's page and you just scroll all the way down. You see how long they've been posting. If they've been posting for three years, it's clear that they put in a lot of work, right? So that's what I do. I look for people like that. They've been posting for three years and I just follow them. And every day I see what they do. I have like a 10, 20, 30 people. I think I'm at like 37 or 27, something like that. But I think that's it. I'm a capital for like 50 of like top people that I feel like are good influences for me and every day that I get online I just get online and I just scroll through and I'm like okay what's working what's working what do I see repeated over and over and over again okay something that I see right now on TikTok if you're in any industry if you are entertaining kids specifically right now it's kind of like the trend you know right now it's blowing up TikTok it's for kids and things like that so if you have any type of business right now Please get on TikTok and just lip sync. That's it. That's all you gotta do. You don't even have to speak. Just lip sync and put text on the um, on the screens and things like that, and like subtitles and little stupid things like that that make them engage. And short, little quick 15 second clips. That it. It's just crazy, y'all. It's crazy. Honestly, go download TikTok and um, go check it out for yourself. Just type in the search bar. Type in if you're a lawyer, type in lawyer. If you're a gamer, type in gaming. If you're a fitness, type in fitness. If you're a podcaster, type in podcast. See what pops up for you. Follow 10 people, 10 top people in that area. Go search them. Go see what they're doing. Follow what they're doing. Mimic it and come back at me. Let me know what the results are, y'all. All right? That's your homework for today. Download TikTok and just go check out to see what is out there and let me know what it is you find and how it is that I could help you. All right. Let me know what industry you're in. Please comment down below whatever industry you're in and let's see if, uh, if we can make something happen. I'm trying to help you guys out and bring some more value to you guys. All right. Lend a helping hand y'all. Two hands is better than one, but three is always going to be better than none, man. Appreciate you guys. Much love. Stay safe out there.